Right, hello everyone. Um, this is obviously a, you've seen by the time, so I'm going to be showing you the silencers, which are a new inclusion to the game. Um, as of about a week now, I think it is. I've not actually come across one in-game just yet, but um, I'm in the middle of recording this video, um, a previous video even, which, um, yeah, has allowed me to have silencers. So, really want to show you what it is. So that's the silencer right there. Basic background, significantly reduces the sound of gunfire and completely reduces any visible muzzle flash, which is awesome. I think that's really, really good. Um, I didn't know how to attach it to guns, but this is obviously how I'm going to show you. It looks like you can get... This looks good. I like this because it seems like they're going to include more than one modification to guns. But anyways, with the guns, this is what they sound like without. Okay, so quite noisy on the assault rifle. Click on it, modifications, and pop that in there. Okay, now look at the front of the gun. Okay, it's got a slight silencer on there. When you shoot this time, absolutely nothing. Like the noise is heavily reduced, which is awesome for those people looking to do kind of, um, I guess if they're looking to do Hitman kind of fights or like <laughs> assaults, but it's just also, I mean, that compared to this, like, how loud that is. Anyways, I'm gonna cycle through the guns to show you it. So this is a pistol, normal. Okay, and then with the silencer, really good. Very similar to the assault rifle noise. Oh, let me slide that up again. So, this one. Oh, actually, the exactly the same, exactly the same noise. Um, but yeah, really good. I don't know if it actually affects your. Um, actually, let's see the pump without it. Okay, it's a pump without. Obviously, pretty loud. Let's have a look at that nozzle. Yeah. Sit down sight. On the end. Yeah, like, like the bolt action, as you'll see in a minute, the, the silencer does cover the iron, the iron sight, but same again, same noise, as always. Okay, right, bolt action. This one, okay, nice, solid iron sight. If anything, you're, are they building a bloody wall? This guy's absolutely going for it. Um, yeah, nice little iron sight. So, when you're shooting at people, you've got a nice clear target. Have I not hit the skeezer? Okay, so yeah, nice and loud. And then when you put the silence on top of this one, let's reload that. Okay, massive, massive silence on the end, as, as always, as it would be. The same again, you lose that crosshair, which is a pain. I mean, does it come back in the lights? Yeah, it does kind of, which is handy. But I'd rather it wasn't so taken up, I guess is the word. Because, <laughs> especially in dark situations, you tend to lose it. It reminds me of Gears of War 1, when I used to stick a little blue dot in the middle of the screen so I could do some no scopes. Yep, I was that guy. Um, but yeah, silencer-wise, same again. Really quiet. Really quiet. Okay. But yeah, that's basically the guns that I want to have a look at. The silencer, I think, is really, really good. A really nice improvement to the game. I'm surprised it wasn't in here earlier. But as you can see, it does need a little bit more work, I would I would say. I mean, I've never, I've never used a silencer on a real gun. So whether you could argue that this is what it would look like anyways when you aim down a gun... Um, just let me know. I mean, it doesn't really affect too much with the shotgun because the app to <laughs> the radius you shoot is so large anyways that I wouldn't really see it affecting, well, using the iron sight. Because, I mean, the sight we're actually hitting is so large as opposed to something so precise as the bolt action. Um, I have a little bit of research, actually, into whether the silencer reduces damage. Let's go and have a little look. Okay, so I've just had a little look up and on... Oh. I'll get that. On Reddit. And this is kind of what I've got. A lot of people are saying that it does reduce. 
So this tends to be the average that I tend to be seeing at the moment. So the silencer reduces the range by 35%, the um, damage by 25%, and the recoil is by 10% as well. I mean, let's have a look at the recoil actually. So we'll do it with the assault rifle to start off with and get a good idea on that. So have I got one attached? No. Okay, so I'll aim. I'll stand right in the back corner here. And I'll aim there and let's see where we end up. <laughs> Can I go up any higher? Uh, I can a little bit more. Okay, so... <laughs> yeah, that recoil is quite a good border mark, I guess. Let's pop this off. I think I just alerted everyone to my location, the sounds of it. Okay, and same again, so I'll aim there. Uh, to be honest, I didn't see much difference. Let's have a look on the bolt action. Bolt action, it was a good idea. So bolt action usually will aim there. So that would be right on the cross. Okay, so I'm slightly higher. It does seem to waver away, but that's just what the bolt action does, really. Okay, same again. So, massive nozzle. And I believe that's right on it. Honestly, I'm not seeing much difference. I don't know whether you're seeing any difference on the recoil there. But I can't see too much. I don't know whether that's just me or what, but I'm not, I'm not getting anything from that. Um, but yeah, that's basically science, sir. Um, cool inclusion, as I said, really good. Um, loving the changes that Rust does at the moment. People are saying they find it quite boring, but I think that Rust is such a game that gives you such an open atmosphere to do anything that you should just embrace it and just crack on whatever you want. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all I can really go into about science, sir. Hope you found this decent. Um, yeah, I kind of like my first kind of tips tutorial on this thing, but yeah, I'll, I'll probably do plenty more. Anyways, cheers.